Thank you guys so much for joining me. I am up really, really late because I am here to give you guys the tutorial for the number one voted style from last week. And I am, of course, I'm always excited to give you guys tutorials for the styles that you guys love because it's just what I do. It's what I love. So, um, I usually don't feature product um, during these this, the DIY styles for the number, the top two voted styles of the week. But this one, I figured that I would just because it was kind of a big part of the style. And that is this Gyra Edge Control. So I don't know if you guys have seen or are aware of this product, but this is the product that I used for this style. So I'm gonna use it in the tutorial for you guys as well so you can see how well it works on my hair. All right, so I've already sectioned out my hair into two sections for this style. I've got this ponytail back here, and then I've got this section up in the front. It's about a medium-sized section um, that I'm gonna be working with. This is one of those styles that you can actually do on wet hair or damp hair if your hair is like, if it's wash day and you wanna do a cute updo. This is something, one of those styles that you can do um, you don't have to have stretched hair in order to to get this look All right, so the first thing I'm going to do of course is brush that section out with my Denman brush then I am going to Flat twist this section in the front and I am going to flat twist forward and This is kind of gonna be not a really really Secure twist. I know in the style it looks really secure. I mean it, it is but it isn't so you want to do it like right in between. I know that sounds a bit ambiguous, but It's not tight, but it's definitely not loose either So it's like right in between there and the only reason I'm saying it's not tight is because I'm gonna push it back and I need to have a little give I need to have a little bit of give in the twist in order to do that. Okay. So I'm gonna twist this all the way down to the bottom and I'm just gonna leave it like this for now because I'm gonna come right back to the back, section the ponytail into two sections and all I'm gonna do here is twist each one of these sections. Nothing hard about this at all. You guys, this style is actually super easy um, and you can do it really quick. I love styles like that. That is what I adore and what I try to bring you guys is styles that are really easy but are really, really cute or sophisticated or I mean just all different types of styles but the bottom line is that they don't take you a lot of time but they look like they took you a lot of time. Okay, so I've got both of these sections twisted and you guys, all I'm gonna do is tuck these bad boys under and secure them with bobby pins. That's it. You may need to use multiple, you may only need to use one, whatever works for you. All right, now for this, all I'm gonna do is bring this back and kind of wrap it around, kind of wrap it around this ponytail in the back. But you see what I mean about having a little bit of give there? And so from here, if you don't, if you like kind of the looser look without, you know, your edges really laid down you can leave it like this and I honestly I actually like it a lot like this as well um, I'm just gonna pin this down a little better back here however when I did the style I did secure my edges um, really well so what I'm gonna use for that is this edge control and a toothbrush. I know it's it's probably sounds really old school. You probably have done this way back in the day. I still do it. And I don't lay my edges very often. It's just not um, the styles that I typically focus on. But you guys, this stuff right here is the business. 
Okay, so I just kind of lay it on there with my fingertips. Okay, secure it all with my fingertips. And it's, it's thick, but it's not pasty necessarily. It kind of has that conditioning feel to it. And all I'm gonna do is kind of smooth it out with this toothbrush. I'm gonna smooth it up, smooth it up so you get that really sleek. And then I got a little extra puffiness back here that I'm probably gonna secure. Let's secure that with a bobby pin. Okay. But you guys, I like, am so feeling this stuff, I can't even begin to tell you. Okay, so I just smooth it, I apply it with my fingertips, and then I smooth it out with the toothbrush. And kind of back up into the twist. Okay. And that is it for this style, you guys. And that's a really, I mean, it's just a really nice look. The hair looks so nice and just the shine is beautiful, you know, but it's so tamed. Your hair is so tamed with this stuff. Okay. So that is it for the final look. Not a whole lot. Like I said, that ponytail is just twisted. Okay. This flat twist is just pulled back kind of wrapped around the back, and then just make this up, section up front nice and smooth and sleek, if that's your preference. Thank you guys so much for voting. Thank you for your continued support. Don't forget to subscribe, and of course, if this tutorial was helpful, please be sure to give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Take care.